Evening. Now, this footage of documentation is in regards to the E90 chassis headlights. Uh, more specifically, uh, I'm focusing on the signal lights. I do understand that you might be having some contact issues or some uh, concerns regarding the socket not being able to produce power for the signal lights. Uh, actually, I have your return uh, signal socket already uh, installed or plugged in on to a brand new headlight just to confirm that uh, the contact with it, even though you had to uh, kind of bring it out and modify a little bit, I am confirming with you it does work. So I have actually a 12 volt power supply which I've figured out the, the uh, pin layout for this headlight. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate by turning it on that the signal light works. Turning on, uh, you can see that the signal lights illuminate. Uh, I can see it from the, the, the reflection from the, the, the table. So pulling it out, I just want to confirm with you. This is actually your return uh, signal socket. How I can know is uh, we see or we notice that you've actually trimmed and modified all the teeth to have it removed, which we're not too sure why you've done so. And I can also see that you've attempted to pry out these prongs, which I'm not too sure if you or your installer added some more extra metal contacts or soldered something onto it to have a better contact point. Even with this slight modification, I understand that this no longer locks into it, being the case that you've already trimmed off all the teeth. I'm still letting you know that this does work. So this is actually a brand new signal socket which you probably received replacements of uh, with the teeth still intact and you can see the difference between it that you shaved off and then the ones that's brand new on my uh, left side. And then you can see the contacts how it's a little bit different. This one you kind of left it alone however this one I can clearly see that uh, either uh, you or your installer added some kind of metal contact to uh, onto this thing. So even a brand new one showing you once plugged in making sure that the teeth are aligned to its correct spots twist to, to lock, got it locked in works with no issues so again it's just mainly the matter with the contact points not touching the, the, the copper rings inside the headlights which again I was able to power your returned uh, signal sockets even though everything was modified this concludes the video documentation. Thank you so much for your time.